All right, how's it going, everybody? Uh, it's been a while since I've made a video. I had a new uh, tablet that I got recently for Christmas. It's got a front-facing camera. It's kind of crappy with the audio, so I figured I'd do it on this computer webcam. Uh, recently, I had to go to the ER. I actually went to the doctor first a couple of weeks ago. They had this really bad, like, sharp pain, like, all down my back and it started with my back and then it went down all down my leg and my left leg and then it went all the way down to my foot and it got so bad to where like I was like limping like I couldn't even walk on it and it sucks and went to the doctor and they uh they just gave me some muscle relaxers and stuff and thought maybe it was just like a pinched nerve or that I was having muscle spasms and stuff and so I took all that stuff and it went away a little bit and then it just got like worse and I couldn't hardly even walk and now it got to the point where I believe it was like Friday, Friday afternoon I couldn't even walk like I was stuck upstairs because I, we, me and my girlfriend, we live upstairs and her mom's downstairs and I couldn't even get up, I couldn't even hardly get up to the bathroom so they had to come and bring me stuff and I'd stay upstairs and finally Saturday Saturday afternoon after my girlfriend got off of uh, what do you call it, work, I had to go into the ER and I had to be like on a wheelchair all the way in there and got back there and usually they're packed there but surprisingly they weren't. But, um, sorry, I was thirsty. I got back there and I had Googled it a little bit before and I thought it was, uh, it's called, I don't what it's called, Skeptic. Scat that's like sciatic, sciatic, sciatic nerve, and everything I was looking up, it pretty much pointed to that. It's like just like a nerve that goes all through your body, and it's like usually if it's pinched or something, it's something like with your starts with your lower back, and usually it's caused by like having a, like a disc moved or something like that, or. Anyway, well, like I looked all that up and it says that it starts from like back there and then it'll radiate down your leg to your knee, past your knee and to your leg and totally the same thing that I have. So now I'm upstairs with, as you can see, crutch on my left side. It's only on my left side, which is weird. And to have that, just go to the bathroom or anything and then when I go downstairs, I have to... I have like, luckily we have a railing, I have the railing on my right side, and then I have the crutch on the other, but I can't really even put any pressure on it, and it sucks so bad, like it's, you really take for granted having your feet and your legs and shit, and it got me on more meds, like I got, show you, I got like, they made me have, uh, I got, uh, Mobic, which is a type of, first doctor gave me Mobic, it's just like a mediocre uh, muscle relaxer. And then they gave me hydrocodone from the actual doctor just for pain, which it helped a little bit. Then, when I went to the ER, they gave me um, some other muscle spasm ones that are more higher, which are uh, Valium, and then more hydrocodone. But really the best... More or less, the volume pretty much kind of makes me sleepy. Every once in a while it does, but I'm not really sure. Like, honestly, I think the volume, when I take the volume with the hydrocodone, it helps a little bit. But other than that, it just, like, does not go away. Like, if I put any pressure on it, it's just like I can, it's like somebody almost, like, getting your leg like a Charlie horse almost. But it's just like every little, every little part that I put my foot down on, it hurts. And I mean, it's, I can somewhat walk, walk on it, but when I do, it's just like instant pain. But what was weird was the Friday before I went to the ER that night, it had been hurting a little bit more. And I had gotten up to go to the bathroom, and how I'm laying on the bed, I lay on the the uh, right side of the bed. So when I get up, I automatically get this foot, just my left foot, and push down while well, I get up. And it's just like a fire, just like burning. Like somebody just got a fucking big old deal of fire, just like lit my fucking leg on fire. And I just like, 
grab the fucking wall and grab the bed. And my girlfriend or my wife's just like, what's wrong? What's wrong? You know, and I'm just like, what? Just fucking, ah. She's like, what? What? And I lay back down. And I could, like, not put any fucking pressure on it. Like, it was just, like, on fire. And as soon as, as, soon as that, I was like, okay, we're going to the ER tomorrow for sure. Because it was fucking horrible. Like, I couldn't. I, like, wild to the bathroom. And just to sit down on the pot, like, it was fucking horrible. So, I mean, any kind of back pain, I did not put <laughs> anything for people that have back pain. Believe me, that I'm sure this is, like, mediocre compared to, I have, like, an uncle that's, like, he got into an oil field accident where a uh, drill pipe fell and fucking hit him and knocked, like, a disc or something, ruptured, like, two or three of his discs. And he's been on pain meds the rest of his life. He can't fucking work. And, I mean, even with his pain meds, he's, it's fucking horrible. So no comparison to that, but believe me, you, any person that's never had back pain, if you have anything near that, you will fucking take your, you will take having your back and be able to bend over and do kind of, do all kind of other shit. Take it for granted big time, believe me. And I mean, like I said, this is just, they say this is just more just like a pain. It's not an actual, like, just a term, more or less, because it's the sciatic nerve that goes through your body. It goes all down there, but it's it's pretty fucking bad. Like, the worst out of all my kind of pains that I've had, minus with my teeth, because I've had really bad teeth aches, but it's pretty fucking close. Like, it's, it's bad. But, um, like I said, since then, I've been... I mean, I, I move a little bit because they say not to just, like, sit around, you know, and stuff. And I've been, like, I get up to go to the bathroom. Like, it's pretty much, like, like this is pretty much my whole place. I feel like, okay, where I'm at, this is my nightstand. You know, look, there's all this shit there. It's pretty dirty, you know. You can't get up. I got my crutch right there. My dogs are in here with me. And they, you know, they go. They pretty much hang around in here for me, which is pretty decent. And uh, the bathroom's like, I'm not going to get up because I can't like hold the computer and all that. But it's pretty much like maybe, let's see, probably like what, maybe 20 steps from here, 25. But it fucking sucks, I can tell you that much. I mean, I ain't, I ain't. I'm not nobody to just sit here and just, like, complain, you know, and just bitch about stuff and all that crap like that. I mean, I do bitch about some stuff, but definitely shit like this, it does suck. I mean, it's right up there with tooth pain, like I said. And my girlfriend, she's, bless her heart, I mean, my wife, bless her heart, she's had back pain. She's been, in, she's had surgery before because she actually had a disc messed up and she was like 14 and they had to do emergency surgery on her so her back's kind of it's been kind of giving her hell like all a lot too and if she uh if she's on it a lot you know and she stresses it out a lot it'll give her pain and with her having to help me you know get stuff and doing stuff for me i know it's like putting a strain on her but it's like it's you know there's not really much else i can do and She's just her and her mom because they're both, they both like had a lot of medical problems and stuff. But I mean, they, I think she now, my wife, I think now she like is realizing how much I've, I've always done, you know, and do to help out. That it's like, you know, she's realizing what I do that me not being able to do stuff like that. She's just like realizing, you know, hey, he does do a lot, you know, even though. You know, someone just thinks I'm just not doing shit since I don't have a job and all, but, I mean, it's a lot, it's a lot of shit more than you think, and we kind of bicker a lot, but, like today, she was saying something about, uh, that she was stressing out and stuff, and I had said something, or she had came up here, and she was doing something, just her and her mom were going to go do some, uh, what do you call it, uh, mom has physical therapy that they go swimming with. And her mom was like, what are you doing? You know, it's almost time. And she was like, what? I can't hear you. Because we're upstairs. And they were yelling at each other. And I, I was like, well, you have fun with that. And, and she was like, well, we're kind of stressing out. You know, geez. And she had said something before that that I was like, uh, what are you calling her? Uh, 
guilt tripping her. And I was like this close to being like, uh, really? You were just doing that to me, you know? But I didn't say anything because I know she's dealing with a lot. But I just think now maybe she'll, you know, realize that what all I do that I do more than she thinks. And I don't know. It's just crazy though. But I figured I'd do an update. I don't really think, I don't think I have a lot of people that really even fucking watch this, so I'm probably just talking to everybody, but fuck it, it's something to do, and I like doing it, and still doing the vapor cigarettes, I don't know if anybody watches or knows about that, but I've had the same, same one for a while, and as much as I smoke them, I have two batteries, and I forget to fucking plug them in at night, so now I'm having to like plug one in, take it off, puff a little bit, and then spit, and then plug it back in. Pain in the ass. Other than that, they're really good, but. You know, that's about it. Uh, I'm going, actually, I'm going back Wednesday. That was the thing I was going to talk about. I'm going back Wednesday for a new, see a new doctor that's actually a doctor of my well, girlfriend and mom, so we're going to let her know, like, what's going on. I met her and stuff, it's going to be kind of awkward, you know, because she sees both of them. But, I'm to the point where I really don't give a shit. I just want to see if there's anything they can do, or give me something that'll help me work and walk more, and not be fucking like an invalid sitting up here, it fucking sucks. So, uh, well, that's about it. Uh, what else? This is actually one of the longest videos I've ever made, actually. Hitting 12 minutes right now. Anyway, that's about it, really. Uh, if you ever get bored or want to check out my videos and watch stupid shit, you can watch some of this. And like I said, if you're interested in reading about that, how do you say it? Sciatic? Sciatic. I keep wanting to say sciatic for some reason. But it's sciatic nerve, and that's pretty much what they pretty much like diagnosed it as that I pinched the sciatic nerve somehow or some way and shit. And if you want to look it up, it's pretty fucking crazy. But, uh, that's about it, really. Peace. I'm out.